Hi, my name is Sean Beasley. I wanted to introduce you to a little bit of DTL work that a lot of people are asking for. In today's world of computers, there's a lot of screen real estate that's being unused by some programs. So here we have an example of the Q overview in the small view. And here you see there's text that's been shortened, the URL. If you go, if you navigate over the points, then you'll see that there is um, more to this subject than meets the eye. Even in the um, tooltip, there's still more text that's being shortened. If you use a large monitor and you want to use more of this monitor real estate for the subject, you can do that by editing one of the DTL files. So here, we are on one of our consoles or on the console for this system. If I move to kernel, output, HTML, standard, then I have a list of all of my DTL files that are responsible for the presentation of the web interface. For anybody that's not used to editing DTLs, the name of the DTL that you want to have can be found here in the action. So I'm looking at agent ticket queue. So if I look at agent ticket queue, I see that there's only one file, but there's two parts to this agent ticket queue. As we noted previously, we're in the small view. So if I look at my listing, I have agent ticket queue, and then I have agent ticket overview, medium. I also have agent ticket overview nav bar, nav view, um, agent ticket overview preview, and agent ticket overview small. So this is the one that I'm going to want to actually edit. If I search for the subject, then I'll find the declaration of the text field. And if I continue to go down, then I'll find a line about the last customer subject where there's a limitation set here for 30. So if I edit this field, then I can actually expand the amount of characters or I can extend the amount of characters that are being shown within the preview. Let me go ahead and do that. And I'll set it to 100. I'll then save my document. Now if we reload this screen, we'll see that I've used more real estate for the subject and I see more of the actual title. Now, there is one problem with doing this. You never really know which screen resolution your agents are going to be using. And you never really know which size of browser they're going to be using. So if I resize this browser window, then I see depending on the amount of tickets and the amount of, uh, and the amount of long subjects that I have, I'm actually going to get a very ugly representation of this subject. Things are going to get out of whack and uh, you just need to know this before making any type of change like this. The same thing happens if I increase the text size. So this is one of the reasons that it's actually been set to such a small number as 30 because of this type of thing that you can't actually control what the agents are going to do when they have their browser windows open or which type of device they're going to be using. I hope this information has helped you and thank you for watching.